frère qui 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 mi 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 c'est fishy fishy um i'm out on the watch bar kingston pre-fishing for everybody so we're lipping them for the tournament next week <laughs> uh i started to go take talk and i thought ah i'd rather do the youtube but we'll see I kind of hate to do the the upside down. Hey, Marilla. Hey, Dale Hayslip. Mullet man. Catfish fever at doors. What's well, a dinky bar? I just caught a 32 pounder. What are you talking about? Hey, off the hook. Hey, Eddie Gross. Just because everybody else can't find don't mean I can't. <laughs> hey, Terry Stanfield. Hey, Skull Rush. Hey, Rob Fox. Hey, Fresno. Avid, how you doing? Driving and listening. Oh, yeah. That was one where my hands was itching so bad because that stupid fish tore them up. That's why. Hey, crappy day fish on. How you doing? Good evening. Yeah. I caught two. I caught a five-pounder. I doubled up with the 32-pounder and the six-pounder. Then I caught a five-pounder, and I missed two. Hey, cool cats fishing. Sleeping and listening. All right. Hey, Dan, da Daniel Berry Sports Highlights. How you doing? I'm trying to look at it from an angle. Hmm. Let's see. That's a new name. Table Rock Guy. How you doing? Keep your phone on, James. He, <laughs> <laughs> Uh, if you only knew, I didn't even tell him. <laughs> we may need to check my prop. <laughs> but it'd be all right. <laughs> uh, I went to the deep holes and wasn't nothing in it. Well, it wasn't nothing showed up on my sonar, but we all know how my sonar is. So I thought, well, I'm going to the shallows and there's all kinds of stuff jumping around me. Hopefully, I only caught three skipjack today. So hopefully I can get some bait. Probably not enough gas. No, I filled up. My boat's full and my my truck was full. I think it's less than three quarters now. Yeah, if you left one foot of water. Um, I'm anywhere between four and eleven. Might be casted off in 18, not sure. Different directions. But it is really shallow up here. Oop, there's a bite. And I'm on a tripod instead of my usual thing I hold the phone with. I ain't even got a heater going or anything. I just put a jacket on. How did you tear up prop up? Well, I'm not saying I tore the prop up, but I heard it go <laughs> on the ground. So I did assume that was good. Well, it could have been the ramp I heard it hit. You're his neighbor. Won't you like to be my neighbor? What's the temp water temp up to, Jody? It didn't tell me. I looked. Well, it said it was 73 degrees. I know that wasn't right. Then you tore. <laughs> uh, technically, I only gave $62 for it from Amazon. So I can get another. Mike Sampson, how you doing? Can I say something sampy? You sure can. Blue rod was moving. They're all green. Mad cat. That's my new rods. I think I've caught a fish on every one of them now. So the new jig rod jigs is off. They're the green. Let's see. Green. Green. Okay. I think Sappy been hacked. He got a new phone and a new number. I got a text from him saying he got a new number. 
I guess I'd call it and make sure it is him. Hey, Donald Long, how you doing? He's not blue. That's because I don't know why. I'm liking my new Garmin. Got it dialed in now. Well, that's good. I ain't got no shoes on, but I am. St my feet are starting to get a little cold. I was thinking about putting shoes back on, but then I thought, well, maybe I could put two pairs of socks on. Or I could just put them on a blanket on the ground. Maybe they wouldn't be cold. I hate wearing shoes. And I've stabbed myself two times with the Minotaur hooks because I put new ones on. Dang, they're sharp. That blue cat bit down on me and stuck that in the side of my hand. But it didn't go past the barb. Hey, Mike's Fishing Home, CFF. What's up? Before you hand to bed. I'm down in Kingston, one of my favorite places to fish. One of the easiest spots to fish for me, actually, too, because it's so easy to anchor. Actually, this is where James had to rescue me that night when my boat went to start and the wind was blowing real bad and the anchors went to hold from the wind. And I was dragging down into where the barge traffic is if it come, when it comes up. So, I thought I saw another one getting messed with. The coyotes are real thick tonight, too. You're sending a new person request. This is real sappy. I will put a picture of me tomorrow. Okay, new Facebook. Yeah, just worked 10 hours feeling, ugh. You ready for the 30th? I sure am. I won't have a new boat by then, but this one to do, or I'll use James's one. Hey, Denise, how you doing? Your fish has gone carp. I never caught a carp. Get carp. I wanted to stay out all night till the storm hit, but I won't have enough faith. I'm already on my second skipjack, and they weren't big ones either. I only got three. I brought a bag of frozen crap that had been thawed and rethawed out of the freezer. You're doing awesome. Cool. Cool. I do have one rod. I could probably move a little closer in. One, two, three, four. Well, you can see them, though. But I can tell the temperature drops. And I don't know. My feet may have got wet up there. Because I threw the cast net earlier when I first got here around the docks and it get anything. But I was hoping these lights would bring them in real quick. I might throw real quick and see if there's anything up there. Um, hey, Brian B., catch a dang fish. Why don't you? I already caught three. I just before I went live, I thought, eh, I didn't know if Daryl and them were still alive. Then I thought about going on the TikTok, and I thought, nah. I did that the other night. You have to turn your camera a different way. And it's, I don't know, it's weird. Sometimes I can hear fish swimming into my tunes. Go fishing for cats where you skipjack fish. No, I was fishing from the bank at a different location in a park. I was an ancient mariner combo in the drawing. You want it? Congratulations. You see me on TikTok? Yep. We managed to scrape up a little flathead and a little blue. We got 12 pound flathead and a 10 pound blue. Hey, Dallas, how you doing? Hey, George Ray, how you doing? You will send your, I got your new number. You didn't send it to me, but I'll call it tomorrow and make sure it's you. How about that? Because I know your voice. <laughs> I can hear him right now. Stuff jumping around me. Either sturgeon or um, striper. It'd be fun to get a striper right here, shallow as it is.
This is close to where Kaz got her uh, spoon bill, too. Never, well, actually, they far from James and Sturgeon. You want to know the truth about it? You never know what you're going to hook down here. Hoping to go fishing Sunday. Well, I hope you get to. What's Mike laughing about? <laughs> yeah, the fish are definitely active tonight. Or well, they are down here. It might be because it's that rain's coming in. I'm going to walk around this camera without knocking it down. I almost dropped it in the water trying to get the release of that 32 pounder. Just in case Mac has to get something turned in this week. I'll take a third place, but you know that ain't going to be no third place win. I ain't even ate my dinner yet. I got. I stopped at um, Little Caesars. If you hear, see them rods moving a little bit, that's where I'm up here walking around. Do, 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 do. All right. I'm a, oh, Jim sent me this cast net. It's a Betts Blue five footer. So thank you, Jim. Appreciate that from uh, them damn river boys. I tore mine up. He had this one to get you. So he's kind enough to send it to me. And it's really easy to throw. Yeah, <laughs> when I released that in earlier, let's try and slide this rope on the way. Oh, I want to get nothing. Well, probably got my anchor. Yep. Is that one little shad? I don't know what that is. <laughs> A little bit striped bass. I throw him back. Did I catch him with a hook? Oh, I've got two of them. There you go, little buddy. Be free. They're perfect size, though. We're back here. Watch me not catch another one after I went live. So that'll be okay. Not really, but it'd, it'd be all right. I haven't seen any shad. In front of the steam plant, there was some shad, but they had it ramped off with these big old saw horses. So I couldn't even use that one. Had to use this one. Nothing in that throw. I'll throw one more time. I believe I'm pulling my lines in on the new boat. And then Dag bless the dogs. Like I said, I'll throw one more time. I'll throw off the side. Some things are over there. Man, that's easy to throw. Yeah. 
Nope. Put it back here. Okay. I'm back. Mm. I'm there. I figured out a pattern here, and Brandon and Bobcat are on the Tennessee. Good luck. I'm not on the Tennessee. I'm on the Watts Bar, where they're going to be having the King Cat Tournament next weekend. A lot of them come down, start coming down yesterday and today to pre fish it. So there's my shoes. There's a pair of fresh socks. Heck yeah! And they're not even James's. <laughs> we were talking about the stuff on the 30th. Yep. You should get in that tournament, Jody. I don't have uh, the live well and stuff. I don't think my boat would pass inspections. I mean, I don't know where to go to fish it. You know, I mean, I'll catch anything that day. I, I'm better at night than day. It's a day fit, a day tournament. <clears throat> There's no sake on. I got something called pizza puffs at Little Caesars. They look kind of like a bagel bite. But it's okay. And I got some crazy bread I didn't open. But I only eat. I think I'll eat one of them baked puffs. I had a fish on them when I was trying to eat the second one. Made the executive decision to throw it down, so I don't know where it landed. Jody, you go through rods like a like you do toilet paper. Just kidding. What rods are they? They're the signature three from Mad Cats. The green. And I love the handle on them. I'm not big on that puzzle handle. You know? But these have a different looking one. I probably need to cast out again anyway. But that handle's different. I thought that was pretty. Looks like mad cats. Yep, they are. Take James bumping. We don't know how to bat. We ain't got the rods or anything to do it with. The real. The first fish I missed because it was foul hooked in a gut part. So I'm going to cut this off. That pocket didn't fail out. I could do a first piece. Save that piece for later since I need it. The head piece ain't been touched all night. So I need to throw it in the spot. I hear stuff over there jumping. There you go. Let me go for it. Let me go for it. Let's see. Let 
And I got a topic to ask you about. As soon as I get these thrown out. Got some kind of grass on. That cat's pretty good. So the night catch real too. Thanks, James. Get rid of that out of the way. Okay. Hey, Kim Burris, how you doing? Okay. Hey, M and T. See if I miss anybody. Want to be outdoors? I don't think I missed anybody. If I did, I apologize. I'll say hello right now. Howdy. Okay. Um, that Hannah Barron. They called her out for being manly. Her of all people. Manly. Because she worked around the house. And because she catfished. There's no way that girl's manly. She's a knockout. But I just thought that was so weird. You got some people high maintenance and polluting and judging. You love my jacket? Thank you. You can get it at catfishclothing.com and use Jody20 and get 20% off. The I got a blue one too. I was going to wear tonight, but I thought, hey, I'll wear green to match my rods. <laughs> hey, burrito catfishing lady. Some people think I'm tomboy. I am tomboys. I've always been. But I don't know. Sometimes I'm girly. Most of the time I'm not. As I pull bait out of my pocket. <laughs> 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 hey, Evan. All right. You can come up anytime you want to fish. Just let me know. Curse of the camera to get another fish since I've been live. And they are just popping over there. Maybe I should, if I did motor, I couldn't see them. I just have to guess where they're at. It is dark. 
and they probably just move somewhere else and jump. I'm kind of off to one side of the river. Usually this spot I can sit on that and catch them though. It's not my best spot, but I can get at least double digits here, usually. Brown be catfishing. It's hard to watch the rods in the camera. I like to turn around and watch them. Hey, hunting and stuff. I missed you. Here, kiki, kiki. Bram, bram, bram. Meep, meep, meep. I wonder if I cut the lights off a second. What happened? Complete chaos. Ah. The coyotes is really bad tonight. I mean, they went on and on and on. I was like, my God, man, give you a break. The shallow, sometimes when you're shallow, the lights scare a fish off. But I try not to cast too close to the boat for that reason. But then the lights will bring in bait fish, which sometimes brings in catfish. So you never know what to do. You didn't miss much, you just got here. Well, welcome in. We're just doing a little kitty fishing before the rain comes in, storms. Ta -da. Hey, quiet man, Curtis. He lives. Any luck tonight? 32 pounder, 5 pounder, or 6 pounder before I went live. And when I went live, I had a nibble. That was it. I did go like 70 foot hole. Wasn't nothing in it. Usually it's stacked full. So it might be warm enough to work. They've all not going to, to the deep anymore. So I thought, well, I'm going to go shallow. And they was over here. But they may have moved on. I only got six rods out. Ancient's proud of me. Hey, the Gonda. <laughs> hey, Curtis got a name. <laughs> I swear that is the fact. when I heard him say that I'm like I'm never letting him live that down <laughs> Jody you want to go sure Jody you want to go yeah I'm always game to go somewhere Poles look good. Well, thank you. They're my new ones. I got the skunk off of them. There's rope back Bob, otherwise known as Bobzilla. Hey, you, Billy Hondo. Hmm. Hmm. I put two fresh pieces of bait out, though, didn't I? I can't be wasting because I only got a whole skipjack and half of a small one left. Took me an hour and a half, two hours to catch them. Jody, you got shoes on? Yeah, I've I put dry socks on the shoes on. I... My feet got cold. Sure. 
I was, well, I wasn't barefoot. I had socks on, but they got wet, so then my feet got cold. I'm trying to keep from lighting my heater. I'll probably get my little blankie right here. I ain't even got my warm pants on. That's what I need to do, change into my warm, my warm pants. Yep, that already made a difference. Hey, Gregory Lemon, how you doing? <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> when is the new boat coming? I, Bob, I ain't got a new boat. I can't make up my mind what I want. Or, well, I know what I want, but I don't want to pay it. And I found a cheaper one, but then I wanted, oh, there's a good, oh, good point. It ain't deep too big. I'm still learning what they are because um, I ain't used them yet. I can't tell how big the fish are. I'm sure they're small, though. Yeah, it's small. I want to try to boat with it. Hey, Bart. Bart again. Open up a little bit. Number four. I'm trying to keep it with my weight tonight. Thirty-two point nine was that fish. That's locked in at six point three two. It's a monster. A little bloody thing. Hook got them good. They are really, really good hooks. I'll tell you that. I recommend everybody buy them. Is that good? There we go. Sure, I'm up now. You're up what? Could you see the takedown on camera? Or did I have my camera good? 
like I said, I usually don't have it on this thing. I got on them after the live. Caught like another 15. Cool. Sure, I'm up now. Booyah. It's hard for me to keep. I lose track after six or seven. I'd go back and watch the live and pull the numbers. I need to have pen and paper to write it on. I didn't even put my makeup on. Ah. I'm getting bad for that. It's Jody. We looking at the Bimini. Yeah. The old Bimini. I was thinking of keeping the boat and fixing it up and put a new Bimini on it and painting it black and putting this black and green carpet I found in it and put my logo on it. But then I ended up with a sonar and a trolling motor. Then I thought, well, I still got the same old motor, same old wiring, same old trailer. Because I couldn't even bring it when I first left today because the lights weren't working. I'd have it worked on for I could. And I had to go back and get it. When, when the last set worked and I couldn't take it out, I was like, well, crap on toast. What's the use of keeping it? I need something newer and just nothing wrong with it to go wrong. Turn camera up to see poles. Like that. Ouch. That's the hurts. Jody, watch that ramp when you leave, LOL. Well, this is a different ramp, but I have fallen off that ramp. It's probably the second worst time I've ever got hurt in a boating accident. I fall, I had a, my, my boat quit running when I was pulling up to the ramp, and then I could barely get on it one leg, and then the boat went backwards, and then I jumped back on the front of the boat, and then held on <laughs> as long as I could that I fell in the water which was a bad idea because it could have was almost over my head if I'd been much farther I'd been over my head but I, I hit the pontoons all the way down and then I walked it in the walk of shame but I try to be careful around the ramps I always get hurt on them if I get hurt it's around a, a stupid ramp be safe next time. Yep. There was a bunch of, I had to clear the ramp before I could even use it. Had a bunch of dead wood and crap all over it. The water's so low, no one is using them. How much gas you got in your car? I got, I think, three quarters of a tank. I did fill it up this morning, but I, I drove around cut, and used some of it. $62 to fill it up. And my boat was still filled up from last week. I don't ever drive that far unless I go to Chattanooga. You mad at it, the boat? Uh, I hate to get rid of it because it's, first, first, it's the only boat I've ever had. Sentimental. So what I learned in, learned to drive and learned to catfish in it. And I just got a lot of memories on this boat. I hope we don't have to come rescue me. <laughs> I did uh, hear the prop grind. <laughs> and I was trying to get off the dock. So I probably ended up having to put a prop on it. But James is like 40 minutes away. His back's hurting him too. So I'm not going to do anything to make him have to come out. And the more comfy than new. But well, I thought if I could put a better couch on this. And I'm thinking, well, I've got there alone. I've already sunk 10,000 in an old boat. So. 
I guess I'll I'll get something different on that pond. You learned how to wear all white and love it on that pontoon. <laughs> That's right, Bob. Me and Bob pitched on the pontoon. He whooped me in a one v one. I had to wear white. Har 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 har. You're making an enclosure for your pontoon? Yep. The boat I was looking at has an enclosure on it. But it's really the back. Well, it's a, I guess it's got as much room as I'm fishing with right now, I'll tell you the truth. So, yeah, I could use that boat. Uh, it's probably the exact same amount of room I got behind that chair. It's a smoker craft. Um... I can't think of the name. But they ran around 30, 25, 28. Then they got a fancier one that runs 50 something I really like, but I'm not paying 50 grand for a boat. You need a houseboat? I know, but that one has an enclosure. It's not as nice as James's, but it's good enough. I don't have to have the Taj Mahal. I really, really like James's, but it's too heavy for me. I can't, I can't use it by myself. If it got stuck or something, I couldn't move it, push it off. You let you win. I didn't. I say I let you win, but I didn't. <laughs> I don't let nobody win. You should learn that by now. I might take it easy on somebody and go somewhere where I won't catch monster fish. I'm try to might try to level the playing field out, but I never just give away a win. Once you have it, it's done with, and you will love it. Maybe. And I was getting stressed out because I couldn't find a boat. And I'm like, screw it. I have a boat. I'm not in no hurry to get one. I can fish off James's and I got this one. And why stress out trying to find a boat and not get what you want? Thing is, I don't know what I want. I ain't looked at them all yet. There's so many of them. It's worse than a car. A car is easy to buy. You never give away a win. I did it, Curtis. You want a fair and square. Even though Brian made me miss a fish because he had me muted. Hey, Heather. How you doing tonight? Captain Dave thought he was going to outfish us when I come back and beat him with my monster. You do have a nice fish. A boat. We'll find you, Miss Jody. Yep. I, there's plenty of people looking for me, so they come across. I I don't care to have used. I'm, you know, four or five years old. I don't want to go really, really old because I need something to pin on that's going to last me a long time. Liked and shared. I appreciate that. And I would take better care of a, a boat, a nicer boat. Why don't you just fix up that new motor and trailer and what you want cheaper than new? Um, I was thinking about that till my lights didn't work tonight. I just got some, so many things, and that's a new wiring kit. It just seems like every time I turn around, something's tearing up. And I don't know how to fix it, which is my fault for not learning. But I can't depend on everybody all the time to do stuff for me. I have to learn on my own. Heather's doing okay and wants to know how y'all's doing. Gregory said, me and my dad caught a lot of crappie at the local city park. Cool. I bet you eat a lot of crappie. I've never ate one before. I only caught one on accident. Came out after under the dock while I was trying to catch a skipjack on my stuff. Hey, 217. Dave was only 100 yards from us, but had to leave, so he was either loaning his boat or leaving it busy when you caught it. Yep. 
I like Captain Morgan. There's a Captain Morgan on TikTok that's wanting to go fishing with me to get content for his stuff. He tells these wild, crazy stories. Doing good, Heather. How about yourself? Hey, Tim Malina. Mama Malina. You going to bring me a, a fish, fish, Tim? Bring me a bat. Hope you're doing well tonight. I've only caught one live. I don't remember what it weighed. I guess five pounds. I don't remember. Maybe four or something. I just need to start rounding them. Where it's easier to keep up with. Oop, I got cold just then. I wonder what time it is. 12.01. I have to break my heater out. <clears throat> well, it's starting, the dew's starting to fall. I see some top of the chairs wet. So that's probably part of it. Hi, Moon over Miami. How you doing? Hey, Randy. Are you fishing this Saturday or next weekend? I fish this Saturday. Where's the big fish at? Exact snow there. Wow. He loves m and um, I'm going to fish my show tomorrow night and Saturday in Chattanooga for the Daryl's tournament for the Tennessee River King for the belt. But I'm not fishing the Cat King down here. I was met some people when I was skipjacking. They caught a hundred pounder down here where I fish at. I would die. I would literally die. Let's see. I can put this dirty sock right here to help hold that up. Now. I'm going to turn the camera off just a minute. Boop. Do, 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 do. What's going to be on your live tomorrow? Or who? Uh, me and James and Destin and probably Josh. Oh, I need to cut the lights off. <laughs> and, uh, I don't think nobody else asked to come up this week. Dude, I'll be right back. Mac, okay. He wanted pink hats. Who wanted pink hats? Hmm. What did I do with them? Let's cut the lights off. Oh, there they are. I'm putting on my warm pants. There's one leg. <laughs> Gotta go. A game starting. Bye, Tim. Woo-wee. 
Yeah. Need more room. Okay. Now that's done. Oh, so much better. No thoughts. Trying to put my shoes back on. There we go. Bob, that's just because you got pink bloomers. <laughs> What? Fish caught me with my pants down. Uh-oh. Dustin needs his beard back. I thought Dustin looked really nice. That made me th think that's probably what his military picture looked like. Oh. I can't believe that didn't hook up. You did it. I might as well check through the bay log though. Yep. That's that old ratty piece too. Straight cut cookie fish. Oh, it's this is the only one with a spook on it. They might have get hit over here. Let's throw some more over there. May that be easier keeping camera angle too.
Oh, forgot Brian B. It's it's the pins. Hey, Brian Turlinger. <laughs> yeah, sorry, I butchered the name. Tur Willinger. I can't see it good enough to learn how to say it. I'm sorry. How's about cut four mystery? The biggest was a 32 pounder. The rest has been six and five and four, I think. Have I missed anybody? Heidi. I don't like my camera view, but it'll do. Maybe I need to cast, I cast some of them off for you this time. Because I thought maybe it's uh, the lights might be affecting the back. I had a pretty good hit just then, but it didn't hook up. I was quite shocked. Let me plug this charger in. Did it go to charging? Maybe. Hey, Buggy, how you doing? What's the pole color combination? They're um, the green signature series three with the green Mad Cat reel. Six of them. I love them. I like the handle. I like that puzzle. And there's the reel. It's green and black. I really like the handle. It fits in your hand good. And then it's mostly all green with just some little black around the eyes. They're medium heavies. And they're called whatever that is. Signature series three. Sounds been screaming some wild animal. Hey, Dink over stink. Hey, Betty. What is that screaming like that? It's getting on my nerves. Koopa Caraba. Gar Coyote starting back. That's what it is. I was in shower and power went out. I thought a bomb went off, but it was lighting and thunder. Ooh. Can you hear that, stupid coyote? I hope it's a coyote. Hey, 922 Crappie Barbecue. I think he's talking about tornadoes. I missed his first comment. I'm really considering going back to Mad Cat's as any of my rods, Uncle Lou stopped making, yep, or you're stuck. He did have some pretty rods. It's, it's Darryl, I, did, I never got anything but the orange ones, but Daryl had them purple ones, and they was really pretty. Hey, Heather. A werewolf? I, mm, Lisa. Mm. I get spooked easy. <laughs> and I do have to go in in the dark because the storm's going to hit. Brian and all your uncle lose his way. Yep. Followed or Ohio. Yep, they're talking about the storm. I think it's supposed to hit right here around four. 
So I'll probably start getting into the ramp, leaving at three. It's already twelve fifteen. I really hate putting on my rods on one end because then I ain't got them spread out like a spider web because all my baits is toward one side now. But that's where the bite's been. Well, y'all have a great night. I'm out. All right, Lisa. Nighty night. Put my little blankie back on. And I might eat a little piece of pizza. Still ain't had no supper. I see you tomorrow. <laughs> Get it, tomorrow. <laughs> Crazy puff from. It's a, a big letdown just from Little Caesars, right? Oh. I guess I throwed one down when I caught that fish. Them does not look nothing like the picture. I think that's three ninety nine for four. I could have had a toastina pizza roll better than that. I ain't even opened these yet. Ta da! Da 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 da! Let's see if they got any good stuff on them. Da 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 da! Da 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 da! Da 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 da! Oh, crap, fish! <laughs> Who would have thought the down the da the bring in a fish? It slid off my hip. He ain't big. I saw him. It's just where you're shallow. He may be a 10 pounder, if that'll do. I can't really reach him because I got too much crap over here. <laughs> A little rusty. Why are you up here? Yeah. Oops. <laughs> Get up here. You little porky pig. I'm trying to keep my sinker from falling down on it. Because it takes me forever to dig it out. Hey, talkie. <laughs> Where is the hook? Are, is it even hooked? Yeah, through the bottom of the mouth. Get through surgery on the little fella. There we go. 
They're pretty easy to get out, and they cook them really good. Okay. I have to weigh them. You think that fish is crying at once some of your <laughs> pizza bites? Maybe. I can't share that. That's my dinner. Hmm. Hey. On. Um. Okay. Um, the last fish said 6.32. Okay. Easy. <clears throat> Oops. I can't believe I did that. <laughs> Sorry. My hands are slimy. I shamed myself. Let me reset it off on. That's what you get, fish. For showing out. <laughs> hey, Stuart. Did it lock? Yeah, 5.96. Fish abuse. Penalty. He disturbed my da 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 da, -da song anyway. I think that's number five. Open that, you beautiful fishy fish. <laughs> now my hand's gonna be nasty. A nice taco sauce, yeah. Fish down, <laughs> yeah. I got too much crap back here is my problem. I don't need this tackle box or this bucket. I got an anchor back here, rod sock. Time for the rope. <laughs> My hands are sloppy. I'm about to wash them. I got a heater back here in the way. Let's see. Did I keep the bait? Oh no, it ate it. I'm gonna put this old piece back on. No, I, I got one more piece I can use that. So I can, okay. But I can't get to. I better take these two. My next boat's going to have uh, water hose on it, also. So I wash my hands.
Them fish are hitting hard back here. Hmm. I was looking for a rope. They even got a bump board back here. I still got a headpiece. A used face and one skipjack. Hey, Ashley, how you doing? That's my baby who just had a baby. She's coming in this weekend and bringing the baby. That's my... That's the little, little Jody. She's just like me. <laughs> I think she's a heads out in the morning. Sometime tomorrow. She'll be in. Almost time to wake her to eat. Yep. Gotta feed that baby. I've not seen the baby since I was at the hospital when it was born. So I'm excited to see it. Spoil it. Every time I see it, the picture of it, it's changed. It looks completely different. I think that was five fish, maybe. I don't remember. I don't think it was six. I think it was five. So that back yonder. No need to weigh the baby, Jody. <laughs> hey Ricky Poo, how you doing? I think I caught five fish. Only two of them's been on live though. Thirty-two pounder, six pounder, five pounder. I think they. I must say they're all around five and six pounds. Beside the thirty-two pounder. Jody, are you going to watch my dad's live in the morning? Sure am. If I'm awake, I never miss it. I might all not always be talking. Sometimes I, f I do fall asleep during it, but I do watch it every time. It's one of my favorite shows. Was that a bite or was it where I was moving? Must be where I was moving. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's my new six rods. James got them for me. Mad Cats with the Mad Cat Reels. And they're beautiful. They've all been blues tonight, too. And he got me the net and the scales, and I've been using them, too. 
Jody, I said Ricky Poo on your behalf. But thank you, Stuart. <laughs> Lynn, I didn't I didn't watch hardly any of that live. I listened to some of it while I was driving because I was skipjacking. And I happened to watch it just right when Dustin was getting. Well, I watched a little bit of Bob getting sheared. And then uh, Dustin, right when he got finished, I saw that. How's the weather over there right now? It's beautiful. I don't have a heater on or anything. No wind, nothing. I think they're out trying to feed, getting ready for the storm that's fixing to hit. I'm not even in a great spot. I don't know why they come here. I just, I don't know. Just fish is here for some reason. There's nothing. Well, it's a flat in between two ledges. Two deeps. And then there's some stupid pole out in the middle of it with a, a bird on top of it. <laughs> I think it's just a directional thing, like a, a, a be a big buoy, but it's made out of wood. So I guess just because it's the flat in between them two ledges, I don't know. But I I come here quite a bit and fish. James hates coming here because it's small fish. But if I'm not even cast off on the ledge, but if you can cast on the ledge, you can get the big ones running up through it. I ain't had these rods long enough to be able to cast them good yet. This is the really the well. There's one rod I used on James's boat one night, and then I did a live the other night. We caught two fish, but this first time they've really seen action. Randall, I hope you had a great birthday. Randall had a birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Randall. Happy birthday to you. Good night, Stuart. Tim, me, amigo. My dad are going to do fishy crappie, crappie, crappie. Oh, crap. My dad are going to fish for crappie tomorrow morning after the live. That'll be fun. I'm sure you'll catch plenty of them. These are pretty good anglers. You're welcome. Oh, you're staying? Yep. Randall, what date? Oh, back to my dinner. <laughs> I was trying to see if it had any of that good garlic stuff on it when I was doing. Da -da 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 -da. It does have garlic all over it. Oh my God, it's good. I don't eat them without sauce either. Catfish and brim tonight. That sounds good. Sixty today. Well, happy birthday. Nope, that ain't catfish bait. It's Jody bait. It's better than little Debbie. I ain't bored. Nope. I'm out having fun. If I get bored, I'll pick up new spots. Or take a nap. I ain't a bit bored. Oop, there's a bite. It's on this far side, the second one from the end. Ricky Pooh gone to bed. Ricky and Possum. Hmm. 
There's a bird over in that thing. It's going beep, 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 beep. Hey, Jet and Jen, how you doing? Um, I think five. I don't think it's six. I can't remember. But we're going to say five. I'm going to fish till three, hopefully, unless I get cold and have to leave. Or if the rain comes early. <clears throat> Rain's supposed to hit at four. I'm about three, four minutes from the ramp. I never fish far from a ramp usually. Don't have to. Thank you, Stuart. Good night. You just got dumped on in West Tennessee. It's heading my way fast. Ooh, don't say fast. <laughs> You're the catfish queen. Well, thank you. Appreciate that. You're the crappie king. I feel better now since I ate. Two one seven. <gasps> no, nope, can't see my breath yet. <clears throat> Put my blanket back on. It is getting a little cooler. I'll pay attention to, to the wind. If I notice it picking up, then I'll know to check the weather. Poor Jane's probably up keeping the eye on the weather. Instead of getting his rest. Third one got bit. There's a freaking barge. Is that a barge? Nah. Can't be. It must be the dock. I thought I heard music or something, though. Nah. I must be able to see if it was a barge. Better than that. They do come up right there, though. Usually they have an escort that drives in front of them to make sure it's deep enough. Jane's probably warm right now. <laughs> yeah, he probably is. His back was hurting him. He was in bed. I worked 10 hours today. And then I went and skipjacked, then went back and got my boat, and then I come down here. And this is about 40 minutes from where James lives. I don't understand why they just knibble. Oop, that one knibbled again. Why don't they just take it? I mean, it ain't a taste test, buddy. Eat it. You need a heated blanket. I used to have one I slept with all the time. I used to sleep on top of a heated blanket every night. Then it tore up. I called it Fernando. That was a noise, but I don't think it was thunder. Thunder. Da, 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 thunder. 
He's been canibbling for a while. You think he's on? He can't be big. And none of them's been ginormous. They ain't been small though. I mean, they definitely keep her sizes. I wish I would have keep a two a couple of one or two pounder. They, I don't see how they're worth your time eating them. You get enough meat off of them. You got a heated mattress. It goes on top of your mattress. Really? Does your fishing pole tips glow in the dark? No. I think they light up under the black light, though, the whole rod. I like being able to see everything instead of just the rod, though. That's the reason I don't like the black light. I mean, if, you, if I catch a fish, I have no problem seeing it. If I just had them little black lights, you can't hardly see anything except the rod. Hey, Mr. Rogers. I got two lines. I probably need to roll in a little. But it ain't hurting them. Heated mattress. That sounds delightful. I got heated. No, I don't. I get, I get that car back. I did have heated car seats. That was the first time I'd ever had that. They was really nice. <clears throat> and the back was heated too, not just the bottom. I'm going to um, pick this up here just a little bit while I can in case bad weather hit quick. That way I could just roll out and go. Well, it's taking just a minute. But I always try to have stuff ready like that. You never know. Let's see. Put my cast net away. You'll probably see the rods bouncing, but it's warm with walking. If you're watching, Jim, thank you for the cast net. Appreciate it. I ain't going to throw it, though. I don't want to get wet and cold. Oop, there it went. And I missed it because I was up here and can't get to it. Horses. I note it. It didn't commit anyway. It would have been hooked up if it really wanted it. Oop, there goes the third one again. There's that. Put these rods like somebody just in case. I can get them back out. And I need to pick up this bag I dumped out. Then I'll be done up here. Oh, there's some gloves. And some hot hands. Hot dang. And I got a two liter of Pepsi. And a can. There's my billy stick. There's a little one that keeps me toasty warm. Oh, 
There goes the third one again. When I'm up back there, I'll reel that one in because it's probably a little one that's on. I ain't able to do anything with it. Probably so little, but we'll check it and see in a minute. There's that. Okay. Now I feel better at least having that cleaned up. You never know. And we all know what hat can change very quickly on the water. Instantly. In seconds, it can get bad. Okay, I'm gonna check that third rod. I think it's this one, right? No, I know that. Is this one I had to take down? Nope, but no fishes. <clears throat> Jody, what's your biggest catfish so far? I got a 63 pound blue on my birthday, and about two years ago, maybe three, but I think it's two. I got a 43 pound flathead in May that I ain't never been able to beat. And then hmm, two years ago, I got a 16 pound channel cat. Last year, I got a 30 pound striper. About three years ago, I got a 17 pound sturgeon. How deep are you fishing at? Anywhere between uh, 8 to 20, depending on where it's casted at. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. I can't complain. I mean, I've not been fishing hardcore for years like everybody else. I always fished ponds and creeks around the house. And then when I got married, we'd go down in this area and bank fish once or twice a month. About, I don't know, six to ten times a year. We'd camp out a week or two. But I, the biggest fish I'd probably ever caught from the bank was three or four pounds. And they weren't as big as these. I never caught a big, well, I caught a big fish in my pond growing up. But it's, it's big to me, but it's untold how big it was. They didn't think there was catfish in it. I caught it on a bread ball, too. But anywho, that I never caught a big fish, so I got a boat. And then I caught one, and then I started watching YouTube. Someone told me to watch YouTube, and some people in this area, Catfish Day was one of the first ones I watched. And then I just started watching. Anybody who fished Tennessee, I watched them religiously to learn the areas and their techniques. 
Big Mac, all of them. I watched them nonstop. Is a five pound bass. I probably got you beat on the bass too. Of course, it was pond bass, and then I did catch a big in here one night. But you know, it didn't feel five pounds, but it was huge. I caught it on the 10 aught circle hook. It took my cut bait. <clears throat> we um, weren't never allowed to keep the fish we caught out of the pond. We just had to throw them back. You catch a bluegill and it have like 11 holes in its lip. How big was it? I don't know. I think the boats are moving a little. Because I got two through. It seems like all the rods is just barely moving. I think it's turning. The wind. It ain't enough for me to feel it, but it's enough to turn the boat a little. And the wind brings the rain. 12.52. You read an article the other day that an 11-year-old kid caught a 13, wow, 13-pound bass. That's awesome. That is big, buddy. That's something most people will never see in their life. I, I mean, I will never see one that big. I don't try to catch a bass, though, but when I moved back in with my mom, guess what's still there? My little pond. <laughs> so I can go back to fishing it of a night to give me something to do. I can bluegill and bass fish in it. Hey, Molly, how you doing? What's that light out there? That's a house up on the hill. I'm pretty sure that house has a bald eagle nest in its yard, in a tree. I'm pretty sure that's the house with it. The bite has definitely dropped off, though, ain't it? Dun, 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 dun. It is 12.53. Do we want to move? Or we want to ride it out? I can still hear fish biting and uh, flopping and breaking water around me. Let's cut the light off a couple minutes. Let's see what happens. Dun, 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 dun. Dun 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 Nothing yet. I'll let you know. The fish got closer jumping though all of a sudden. I didn't put my cast in there, but I don't want to get wet. If I get wet, I need to put them hot hands on. Um then I would get cold. A little fuzzy hat. I'm a fuzzy girl in a fuzzy world. Hmm. Oh, there they are. I think I have a little light here we can use. Keep from running the big one. I do think that affects the bat. Especially when you're flathead, honey. See, come on, baby. Hunk a hunk of burn and love. There we go. That works pretty good. How's that? Yeah. That'll do. We'll do that a few minutes. See if it brings us some fishies. Do you need to call the fish into your bait? Yep. Hey. I think I saw here kitty kitty. But no, it's Samson. So here kitty kitty kitty. 
Ra Wooly, how you doing? Hey, my flathead queen, appreciate that. Oh, there's a bat. It's the third round again. Um, we caught five. Biggest, I didn't catch the 32 live though. Uh, caught a 32 pounder, and then the rest has been around six pounds. When I caught the 32 pounder, I actually doubled up with the six pounder. But I cut the lights off to see if it would make the fish come in and bite me better since I'm so shallow. I think the lights affect it. Now I'm opening a pack of hand warmers. No flathead tonight, though. I'm not. Well, you can catch a flathead anywhere in Tennessee River, whether you're looking for one or not. But I'm not targeting one. But that don't mean there might not be one swimming through here. We went after flatheads the other night, and we caught a 12 pound one. That's all we got. Well, we got a 10 pound blue with it. Then I had to leave. They, they might be camera shy. They might be. Yicky, kicky, kicky. Pram, pram, pram. Mute, mute, mute. I met Gregory and his dad and his mom at CatCon. I had a really good time with them. They're good people. You ever have been around, I, I get nervous and shy and I'm not good in crowds or with new people. But where I, you know, talk to them so much and chat and stuff, I felt real comfortable with them like I'd known them my whole life. Even though it was the first time I'd met them in person. Mm. And you can't say that about everybody you meet. <laughs> they know the queen is on the prowl. <laughs> Same here, yep. <laughs> uh, I didn't go to the place where I had the better bite because <clears throat> sometimes they're there, sometimes they ain't. And I would have had to drove pretty, well, not real far, but I should have went there anyway and got some gizzard shad. I planned on it. Maybe we should. See if we can sit up there in the, them shallows and get some gizzard sets and bait. They're so hard to catch because they're so digging fast. They're just streaking in front of the boat. Zoom, zoom, zoom. But there wasn't no thread fin shad there. Just some gizzards, what there was of the night. All right, we'll cut the light on. It did help. Booyah. I wonder if James has bait. Or if I really need to go get some. Because I'm not going to get any here. But I will get cold when I drive the boat. The wind. Got to go to sleep. See you tomorrow night. All right, Gregory. Sweet dreams. Hmm. Yep, this place probably about fizzled out. <laughs> he hates it when we use his name for other things. Fizzle. <laughs> so of course we do. Let's see. It's 
one o'clock. If I move, I'm going to get cold. And I might not find fish. I need to make sure I got a ladder first so I can light my heater. That's the first step. Is there a working heater? Or a working ladder on, on the boat? Yep. Wait. Booyah, baby. Okay. That answer that. I guess we're moving. Do I really need to say? Should I stay or should I go now? Hmm. That's the bridge making a noise. Something driving across it. Uh, let's see if it works. It was working earlier. I mean, I didn't mark no fish, but it was telling me water depth. Back. Oops, that must have been. Oops, there's a fish. Did I miss it? Ah! Up here. He ain't big, but he's a fish. But his line's gonna get tangled up in. Just that one. I got them kind of close together, so it makes it a little harder not to tangle up. He did get in this one. Talkie talkie. Let's see. Slime all over this line. Anywho. I wanted to show you the hook set. The Minotaur hook. Executioner is my favorite hook. As little as this fish is, it's still set at nine out hook. <laughs> Open up. <laughs> Dude, God, that tooth pad's sharp. Right there in the corner. Right where you want it. Don't poke me, please. Even though I poked you. All right. What do you think he weighs? You think he weighs three pounds?
Okay. Okay, I'm just on. Pounds. Three point seven two. You have a new rods of workout. Yep. Are you asking your shower receipt? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I should sit here and just dink it up tonight. I still have a whole skip jack. I was whining because I wasn't catching fish. But I was just staying catching fish. He's trying to get me. I'm not that far off the, the water. So on the man ain't hurting him. Trust me, if I thought it was hurting him, I wouldn't do it. But I thought him in a little harder than I usually do. He was trying to spy me. I wasn't going to give him the chance. My Let's see, I've already got. I want to hit the little head piece. The boat's turned or if just the lines is moved. I saw one back over there far away. Can't thought it'd get a back there. It's close to the ledge. They're both turning anyway. Really good. Let's My need is where I take it off. Boat turn. All right. Uh oh, my camera went dark. It must not be charging. Let's see what it's on. Hmm. Nine percent, five percent. They do this one.
Yep. That one went to work. And it might have killed the battery. Out. <clears throat> Just a little charger. Hey, Gaza. Morning. 518 UK time. The weekend upon us. Thank goodness. Thanks for coming in. Hope you have a wonderful weekend. And your game. At the Eagles. I definitely put me six fish there. Got that same hoodie at CatCon, did you? Yeah. You're welcome, Gaza. I got it in right I got it in the blue of my bag over there. I was gonna wear the blue, but I thought, eh, I'll put the green on to match my broads. <gasps> Even my lighter matches. You can tell I really stuck a ladder often. Nope. That's an easy flick switch, too. Oh, I need to turn it in, don't I? Voila! There we go. What bait are you using? I'm using Skipjack. I caught three today, and I've used two of them. I'm trying to keep from cutting the third one, but we'll see. I mean, I don't. If I, if I was catching a lot of fish, I'd use it. But right now, I don't have to cut it. <clears throat> so definitely six fish, but maybe seven. I don't know. And they all been about the same size except the first one, which is 32. The lighter is lit, but you don't hear music. Cindy is your bait. <laughs> no. Why would you hear music with the ladder? I don't get it. I cut the lights off for a couple minutes earlier trying to see if it helped the bite, but it didn't. <clears throat> I must have just got lucky with that big one. Cut that back off. Well, I could put it back on a minute. Nope, I dropped it. I gotten weak. James has been netting the fish, and I ain't been lifting them like that. And it was hard for me to get that 32 pounder in over the railing. Nah. 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 Probably needs charge too, because it looks like it's done. I'd rather see them. If a fish wants it bad enough, it'll hit it. I need to save this in case. That bird is crazy. All them weird noises. Sounds like T Rex. A song. Back in the day at concerts, people would light their lighters during the 
Oh, oh yeah, they hold it up in the sky. How come they never burnt their hand or blowed up? Song makes more sense. I've never had a favorite dog. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> There's a cake called Ding Dongs. Hostess makes them. Gaza. There's a light that never goes out. Take me out tonight where there's music and there's people and you're young and alive. Hmm. Everybody, yeah, yeah, rock your body, yeah, yeah, everybody, rock your body, right, bum, 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 back streets, back, all right, the Smith, <laughs> all right. <laughs> Oh, baby, baby. <laughs> oh, baby, baby. Oh, baby, baby. How was I supposed to know? <laughs> I can't say her the lick. <laughs> that something wasn't right here. Oh, pretty baby, I shouldn't have let you go. And now I'm right. <laughs> Show me how you want it to be. <laughs> Tell me, baby, because I need to know now. Oh, because my loneliness is killing me. And I, I must confess, I still believe. Still believe when I'm not with you, I lose my mind. Give me a sign. Hit me, baby, one more time. Oh, baby, baby. <laughs> Better call one of her better song. That's Britney Spears, man. At her peak. No, that is when she first came out. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <sighs> it's a concert. <laughs> it can be. <laughs> I got my sonar halfway working. The down scan. No, the clear view and the side scan's working. But I like that old original view that first come out. That's my favorite view. I don't, I don't care what everybody else says. Oh, this one's better. This one's better. No, it, it might be for you, but it ain't for me. I like what I like. Can I read the others? Yeah. But it don't mean I want to. I like that. I like seeing the arch and them stacked in it and the color scheme. That's just what I like. But I won't do it. Wow. No matter what I do, I can't get it to work on it. Well, Bob run the fish off. Laugh of the world last back, yeah. Hey, <laughs> <I> mullet man. <laughs> Bobzilla reared his head and scared the fish off. I'm surprised that it gets people's dogs barking back. You just probably can't hear them fish jumping, can you? Probably ain't loud enough for you. I saw my breath. Temperature dropped. I got a little bit of a chill. My temperature rising. 
120. I'm afraid to let my heater, I'm afraid I'll burn a hole in my neck. Because I don't want to drag it all the way up here. You think it hurts for it to be by the gas station or the gas can? <laughs> oh, fish. I think it came off. Did. I think that's a headpiece making us work to it. Dang it. I pulled it right out of his mouth. Yep, there's a headpiece. I ripped its lips off. <sighs> that was exciting for 10 seconds. That was some knock and rod. Maybe. A blizzard there. Bob's evil monkey scared them off. Yeah. Thank God I can turn down the volume. <laughs> Kermy? <laughs> I miss Piggy impersonation. Are those the new <laughs> Mad Cat reels also? Yep. How do you like them? I really like them quite a bit. I don't really have the drag set on them good yet, though. The drag's a little hard for me to turn. They are new, but I didn't oil them or anything. They've been hitting hard to be such a little fish. But like I said, I am pretty shallow. I know when I did that, when I gave that big tug, when I leaned back, I felt it right then come out of its mouth. But it went hooked up for the minotaur hook when it slipped. Green machine. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Thank God I turned the volume down. Never. Ever. <laughs> <laughs> I got this bag so it protects my finger. Don't get rained on or the wind blow it out. I had to buy a new one this year. Okay. 
That wasn't bad. Well, there we go. That there be heat. My shirt's steaming from where it's wet. Maybe I should have put it on a different shirt. I wouldn't be cold because then it wouldn't be wet. There's a thought. Catfish dog, send me a friend request. And phone is dead. Got a new phone on Facebook, Sampy. How cold is it there? Forties, maybe. Just barely enough to see your breath. I don't know how cold it is. I don't have temperature. <laughs> you remember this past summer, coldest June ever? Yep. When that's do falls get y'all wet and then of a morning it does it again and it gets right before it gets sunlight it gets cold anybody who hunts or who's out of the morning knows what i'm talking about temperature drops for some reason i was hanging i was hoping that after the concert and all the lighter being lit the lighter would have been empty <laughs> Uh, nope. It was mid-June and we all had coats and hats. One buddy even had a face mask. Yep. I just received a request also, Sampy. Jody got storms coming around 5 a.m. All right. I'm going to leave at 3, but I'll stay live as I go. Because we all know sometimes I have problems at the ramp. <laughs> That's why I stay live. Uh, I'll usually wait till I'm safely in the truck. But they do patrol this ramp. The cops do. Because people park there and they walk and it's got some bathrooms in it. Which I don't um, go to the bathroom. You never know who's in there or who comes in behind you. It don't take long to be um, hurt. It just takes a couple minutes. One time I had to go and 
the, the only time I've ever been in there. And I didn't know the bathroom lots was on a timer. <laughs> and I get in there and the lights go out and I'm still in the bathroom. And I thought someone cut the lights off and was trying to get me. <laughs> I think I called Skull Rush. <laughs> I called somebody. <laughs> Because I said I didn't want to die alone. <laughs> no one know what happened to me. <laughs> My request was that no I can is that you. You had no icon. Hey, Big Bad, how you doing? Well, I don't know. The last 15 minutes is the best. <laughs> uh, Bob Zilla. If the storms we had, look out. We got hail like crazy and it poured down sideways for almost two hours through the winds over 60 miles an hour. I don't think we're going to get nothing that bad. I hope not. You're doing good. But thanks for coming in, Big Matt. Appreciate that. If you just don't have Big Matt, you should. He's one of my faves. I've known him from the beginning. We grew up in YouTube together. The hard streets of the tube. And I got restless legs and my legs bothered. I ain't been able to take, if I take my medicine, I get sleepy. I just have to suffer through it, man. Boat moved just a little bit. Oh, I could, hey, I could take my shoe off. Cause the heater's on <laughs> then i'd be more comfortable yep and if i can take my shoes off then i'm probably take a sock off yep Those are socks. why did we do this heater a long time ago yes matt i'm causing trouble again yeah he is just subbed you matt yep Matt's a good one. Drama free channel. Fun. Homesteader hunter. Tries to fish. Family man. There you go. Back to lurking. Okay, Bob. I'll sing another song and bring you out of retirement. How much is that Bobby in the window? And you'll meet other people on this channel that's in that same community. I go in, I don't just do fishing. I like, I, I like outdoor stuff. Anybody who's, because usually if you're a hunter or you're a uh, prepper, you, you fish or you like to fish. So they all kind of blend together. There's some preppers that are a little hardcore. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Wow, your ears are bleeding still from earlier. Bob, that was one of my best performances. What are you talking about? How dare you? That's like a, my, one of my top eight. Is there a face on that tarp? No. That's uh, my heaters. The reflect that shadow. I call that one Bopsy and that one Mopsy. Twins. You know I like my twins. I could only turn one on. I oh, was the top of that seat getting hot. Yes, James will crap. He put that seat on there. If I burn it. Matt cut that eye off.
go off. Usually you just bang it. Well, there we go. I did it. That was a sinker. Could have easily landed on my toe. Hey, Dominique. Howdy, howdy, Miss Jody. Looks like a face boot haunted. <laughs> you hear you're going to Ohio. Where are you going there for? Hey, Sam. The world famous middle catcher. I, I went up there. He's like, the skipjack or killing it. You'll catch coolers fill. Easily catch 500 in a day. So I drive over four hours. Guess what I catch? One skipjack. After spending hours casting. Not 500 in one, but one. <laughs> Dominic finally caught some. But you know how big they was? The size of a spook. Because I'm like, is them, is them thread pin shad? Nope. <laughs> They're skip jet. I never seen them that small. Hey, Don Johnson. Hunting and stuff. Plenty of tornadoes. Ooh. I don't like the wind. I plan on getting out here in plenty enough time before I have to deal with that. Boat turned a little bit. I wonder if I turn my steering wheel. That would help. Turn my motor. Yep. They did. By Jacks. Over 400 Monday. Mm-hmm. 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 400 what? <laughs> so, aha! Yeah, Rustic probably went there and told him where to cast and tied his lines for him. Didn't he? You know, I was on up to it. Now I got cold with only one heater. I'm going to put my blame shoes and socks back on. We received the bill for those. 40 people watching. Well, thank you. Appreciate it. Nope, I got a bite. See what you done? There's a fish on it swimming with it. It's going. It's going, baby. Don't get off. Did it get off? Did it swim to the boat? No, it swim to the boat. Pretty good one. Maybe fifteen. Barn. Come on. 
Come on, baby, get up here. Quit fooling. Get up there. <laughs> Dang it. It was hard to get in. Well, I can't really get over here. Right? I'm tired. Goodbye. We get to look at him. He's fat for sure. Step over the net. <sighs> Listen to him. Hello, heavenly Billy. <clears throat> He's probably twenty, I'd say. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and get a photo. Ready? Okay. Look at that. That's some good eating there. If you kept them that big. Pound. Watch him clamp down on that, biting it. <laughs> <She's still. laughs> you goofy fish. That would be my hand. It'd be biting on right now. Be still. <laughs> okay, let you down. Is it lock? Nope.
I think we'd say two and a half pounds. That making them hang there till what? Yeah, there goes, doggy. All right. Maybe I can get a better picture this way. There we go. I always got the fin in my face. They tippy toe. Oops. <laughs> okay, that should be good enough. I'll get the neck set back over. Boom. I'm glad we didn't move now. And I got to keep my bait. Was that lightning or something else? Okay. You get it fixed. Hey, 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 J and J. How you doing? <clears throat> Your motor. You think it's a carburetor? Thank you, Terry Stanfield. Hey, Dave Bozarth. <clears throat> <laughs> if you hold them in front of the heater long enough you can have catfish sandwiches yeah it's like something swimming in an alien film well done jody thank you gaza mid tennessee hog catcher how you doing nice one thank you patting and stuff and hillbilly 217 appreciate it You stay up late, it's going to catch you later. Yes, it will. A hot mess, you're telling you. <laughs> Rusted didn't go yesterday. You were solo. Wow. Hey, cool cats fishing. Wrap it up. Bad. Bad what? 
bed. Rain on its way. Alrighty. Time to reel in. Rip, it was fun while it lasted. No bank. This one was foul hooked anyway. No bait.
What's that? What's that? What's that? What's Oops, <laughs> that has a piece of bait. One, two, but I'll probably end up leaving these on the boat tonight. Takes a little while to get everything set up to leave.
I always have my stuff put away for I go to the ramp. That way I'm not playing around on the ramp. When I load up, it means I'm ready to load. Oh, what battery that's on. Still 9% of it really charged up. Almost got her something picked up. Just imagine if I hadn't picked the fry up earlier. Really. It's fish up. I'm trying to get it easy. around as a drive. Maybe the wind won't blow you too bad. It's tough that no boogeyman's at the ramp. Started up hard like a kitten. I'm never far from the ramp. <laughs>
Am I blinding you? No. Okay. Uh oh. I'm backing up too far. Okay. I thought you wrote. Okay. Yep. Got it? Yep. Can you tie off on it, please? Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. You look familiar. Okay. Yeah. Are you from, from Clinton? Yeah. Okay. I'm from over in Scott County. Okay. Um, if we can route two, three times and head back to the long time model. Yeah. You never know. Did you catch any? Uh, I think about eight. Eight? Any good ones? Uh, thirty and thirty-two. And oh yeah, yeah, that's good. Five. Five. Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. Man. If you want, I'll sit here and hold it for you. I'll be tight with it. Right there, baby. What are you in fishing for? Bass. Bass. Yeah. Yeah, I was out here messing around. Yeah. I caught one real quick. I fish on the MLF. Uh, I fish on the uh, three other trees and stuff. I was oh, just out here fooling around. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, I was fooling around with my friend Alan. <sighs> Alright. 
They're fixing to have a big king cat tournament down here next weekend. Catfish. But I'm not fishing it. All right. I'm going to get my truck. It's also you call it 30, Here's the first one I tried. I doubled up. Yeah, six times. Yeah. I used to fish for them. I caught some big ones at the same point on 6XDs. Not even yeah. trying to catch rockfish. Really? Yeah. I catch a lot of big ones on practice. I'm always out here practicing. Yeah. Yeah, I used to catch them at the plants. Don't be, don't be up.
Almost people, right? If we can get this bed we love it. Oops, I looked away, man. My bad. <laughs> Hardly deep enough, I'm afraid. Pigeons in my pocket. I don't need it. Thank <laughs> you. 
back to it. So the stretch, strap the bed down, then we're done. You know, this, I am off the ramp, but you always have to go off the ramp here. Oops, I forgot to put the floor. And the rain's already here at the lightning, too, which is really surprising. All right. I'll be right back. I think I forgot to pull anchor. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm <laughs> <laughs> I did forget to pull the anchor. It's <laughs> back there under the trailer.
Fish north a lot? No, I never go there. Oh, really? That's uh, closer to your house. I know. Well, actually, Cumberland is up to Texas. Oh, yeah. Oh, did you get on Cumberland? I went with a friend a couple times. But then he's not in. Here comes the rain. Yeah. We made it just in time. My friend said it was coming. Yeah, yeah that's what they told me. That's what I told me to get off the yeah. water. Well, good luck to you next time. Sure. All right. Appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. You too. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> All right. We did tie the straps down. So we didn't forget that. Hey, Purple Alley. <laughs> um, hey, Cool Cats. Any fish tonight, half century? I think we got about eight. Biggest was 32, then a 20, and then a bunch of fives and sixes. Jody, get your butt moving. You're so slow. Wait till what you drive through now. It's bad. We nailed it. I've been booking it. I had to unhook the stupid anchor under every rung of the trailer. Okay. 
Let them get pulled out. Everything's good to go. Lights on. Buckled up. You ever go to McDonald's and get a McChicken? <laughs> Don't bother me, man. Okay. I guess I'll go ahead and end because I'll lose service. No. <laughs> I spilled my pizza puffs. But I dropped my bread, but it stayed in the bag, so I still did it. But into the out of the storm. Yep. Did you get in trouble, Joey? Uh, no, not yet. <laughs> and I didn't. I still got like a 40 minute drive. <sighs> but I, I'm going to get the bad store as long as you don't get. Oh crap, thank you for reminding me, Tim. I got a ticket here last time. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Thank you, Tim. <laughs> you probably say, I see lightning. Yep, it's coming this way. What is our year? Really bad at the house now. It's not four o'clock. And I can't put the camera because it takes too, too hard. back in my truck. Thank you. 
<laughs> no lights or anything. Really dark. Jumping into it. Maybe it is even more than the suffering. But I had a nice trip after that. I'm satisfied. Need to catch some fish. That was a call. I didn't really. Did I catch the last one, James? I think we stuck that we did. Then we went out Tuesday night and caught two. I can't remember. I'm pretty sure we pulled the gun. Big bat.
name is Brad, and all of a sudden they were seeing. You think my owner name would go back out again? <laughs> Apparently. So what is it? It has to be doing that. Okay. I'll be my little helper. I think I missed the bad part. Thank you. 